We're at South Broome Main Beach and we have with us the project developers and the construction crew of our wonderful new South Broome Tidal Pool. Let me introduce them to you. We have Yaku, you were the site manager for this development. That's correct. Zola, you are one of the directors of ABD Construction. That is correct. Alma, you were, this was your big baby and you had to work out all the logistics here. Yes. And we have Cindy, who did all the paperwork. This must have been one awesome project to try and keep the sea out of the pool while you did the development. Yeah, most of that onus fell on Yaku to plan the thing right and so that we can work on all the low tides, uh, especially with the concrete work and that, which is uh, quite a bit of money coming in in one go, and it's got to be put in within two or three hours. So it was quite hectic to plan it right and make sure that everything is on time. You had to, first of all, check out when the waves were going to be at their lowest, but you also had to put other things into place, and we're going to ask Yaku about the breakwater that he had to build. Yeah, the um, breakwater consisted of sandbags mm -hmm. that we built on that eastern wall mm -hmm. and uh, we secured it down into the concrete floor mm -hmm. so that the, the sea won't break it. But that gave us enough time to pump out all the water and uh, to get to that valve to drain, to drain the pool. So it worked pretty well. Now the whole pool has been reconstructed from the, the base, the floor of the pool, the walls, everything? The pool was only refurbished. It wasn't built from scratch, it was only refurbished. We drilled holes and put concrete underneath uh, to try and secure it more in place. There's no way you can actually take out everything here and rebuild it. It will cost probably in the region of 20 to 30 million rand to rebuild this pool uh, in the current, current situation. Uh, what we did here is only refurbished it for about 800,000 rand and that will last them another 10 to 15 years then. Now, I think that your construction crew had a different uniform this time. Yeah, I had to come uh, to work once or twice with my wetsuit to go and work inside the ocean there uh, while we were pumping concrete. Yaku never came with his uh, wetsuit, but uh, he was full of water the, most of the time. Right in the dead of winter as well. Luckily the days we pumped, it was actually very nice weather and it was quite warm. I, it, you know, it was, it, everything just worked out nice so we can finish this project a month ahead of time. Well done. Beautiful beach down here now. Beautiful setting. What more could you want? A perfect pool. Thank you very much, Alma. Thank you. And Thank you. Th thanks to the rest of my crew.